Hello guys, welcome back to Bike Geek. In today's video, I'll show you how to increase your video graphics memory on both Windows 10 and Windows 11 PC. This method works for all major graphics manufacturers, whether you're using Intel, AMD or Nvidia integrated graphics and can help improve your system performance and boost your FPS in games and applications. First, we'll check our current video memory and graphics manufacturer. To do this, simply right click on your desktop. If you are using Windows 11, then click on show more options and select display settings. Then scroll down and click on advanced display settings and then select display adapter properties for display one. Here, you'll find your graphics card information. In my case, it's Intel HD graphics. And as you can see, the total available graphics memory is 8,215 megabytes, but the dedicated video memory is just 128 megabytes. So it's time to increase that. Depending on your current VRAM, you can follow the values I'll show on screen to update your settings using the registry editor based on different RAM sizes. And here's what you should follow. For one gigabyte RAM, set it to 128 megabytes. For two gigabytes RAM, set it to 256 megabytes. For four gigabytes RAM, set it to 512 megabytes. For eight gigabytes RAM, set it to 2048 megabytes. For 16 gigabytes RAM, set it to 2096 megabytes. These are the recommended VRAM values based on your system's memory. Don't worry, I've also added all of this information in my YouTube description so you can follow along easily. All right, so first we need to open the registry editor to increase the VRAM on your Windows system. Close any open windows and then go to the search bar and type registry editor or just reget it and choose run as administrator. Now the registry editor is open. Double click on H key local machine, then double click on software. Since I'm using integrated Intel graphics, I'll look for the Intel folder. If you're using a different graphics card like Nvidia or AMD, just look for the appropriate folder. The steps will remain the same. Once you find your graphics manufacturer's folder, in my case, it's Intel, right click on the folder, choose new, then key, and name the new key to GMM. Make sure all letters are uppercase, then press enter. Next, select the newly created GMM folder, and on the right side, right click, choose new, then D word, 32 bit value. Now type this value exactly as it is, dedicated segment size with D, S, and the second S capitalized, no spaces. Once it's created, double click on dedicated segment size file. Now we need to check how much RAM is installed on your PC so we can set the correct value. Go back to the search bar, type system information and open it. Look for the installed physical memory RAM. For example, mine shows 16 gigabytes RAM. Now based on your RAM size, set the value data accordingly. So for my system with 16 gigabytes of RAM, I'll enter 2096. Then click OK to save. After that, close the registry editor, then restart your PC. That's it. Once your system restarts, the VRAM will be updated and you should notice improved performance and better FPS in games and applications. You can also update your graphics drivers through Device Manager. Right click on Windows Start button, then click on Device Manager. Expand the Display Adapter section. Right click on your graphics card and select Update Driver. Choose Search Automatically for Drivers and make sure your system is connected to the internet. If you see a message saying the best drivers are already installed, don't worry, you can visit your graphics card manufacturer's website like Intel, AMD or Nvidia and manually download the latest driver from there. And that's how you can increase your video graphics memory on Windows 10 or 11. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and tap the bell icon so you never miss an update. Also, feel free to share it with others who might find it useful. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you in the next one.